Hey there, Aquarius. Welcome or welcome back to Stars Aligned Oracle YouTube channel and the Lucky Stars community. Cat Star here with your money career reading for the week of December 8th through 14th. As a reminder, my readings are for entertainment and are general in nature. They may or may not resonate for everybody. So please do take what is for you and leave what isn't for those of you liking and sharing the videos. Thank you so, so much. It does help others to be able to see these messages that might not otherwise. Also want to give a huge shout out to all the new and returning viewers and subscribers and to the channel members. Thank you all so, so much for being here. I truly, truly appreciate each and every one of you. Also, if you haven't checked out the membership area as of late, you might want to check in again. There have been some changes and some updates uh, that you just might like. All right, <laughs> let's go ahead and jump in, see what's happening going on coming in this week for you, Aquarius, in money and career. The overall kind of theme or message for woo, this week for the money career reading. Some things might feel like they're upside down, okay? All right. Oh, my cards are getting all the... Ooh, moonlighting. Didn't we get that last week? Moonlighting again, Aquarius. Interesting. I'll link last week's uh, money career reading at the end of the video because we got moonlighting last week with a different deck of cards. Very interesting. So I'm just hearing, Aquarius, it's time to stop playing. Okay. Ooh, jumping cards, jumping cards, jumping cards. It's time to stop playing is what I'm hearing. Some of you... Um, Potentially you've been like showing up and making the moves is what's coming through here. Like going through the motions, but not actually um, putting in full effort is what's coming through. So uh, it's time to stop playing. Stop playing. Whoa. Jumping cards. I just flipped right out. Interesting. All right. Spirit. Let's get... Flipped over, flipped over, flipped over, flipped over. All right. Let's see here what you have, Aquarius. Your overall energy, you have a dream of abundance. As you sleep, God, your angels, and your higher self are giving you divinely guided ideas, answers, and solutions. Be sure to record your dreams in a journal because they contain valuable insights that will help you manifest your desires into reality. So keeping a dream journal and or really, really paying attention and for some of you deciphering your dreams because sometimes dreams come through and it seems like it's one thing, but it actually um, the message is meant to be something else. But it's um, the, the messages are brought through in dreams and symbols and images that... Um, or thought or or right that you will understand or that will make sense to you and sometimes they're wacky and they don't always make sense so uh for some of you keeping a dream journal is going to be imperative for others of you uh getting the i, I believe online they have um like sites or or even maybe videos that will assist you in deciphering dreams but you need to remember that those are very cookie cutter and uh, one size fits all. And that's not how dreams work. So deciphering, um, maybe using that as a key or something to assist you, but also using your own intuition and kind of what certain things mean to you is going to be of uh, the biggest benefit of, of um, for you. Okay, so, but dreaming of abundance. So um, if you guys are dreaming of, you know, certain numbers, stuff like that those could be advantageous for you okay and that stop playing is coming through again so potentially some of you have been getting a lot of information through your dreams and yet you haven't been taking advantage of it instead you're like oh well i don't know what the next steps are or what i could do for a solution and and spirit and divine your angels universe it's like stop playing aquarius we keep giving you the information please use it okay interesting now moonlighting coming out for a second time so this is confirmation the last time it came out was last week's money career reading with a different deck so confirmation coming through for a second week in a row again like i said i will um link that video from last week at the end of this video but this is moonlighting you can start working on your dream career part-time while keeping your other job to pay the bills 
ding, ding, ding. There is a solution coming through right there. So if you are dreaming, Aquarius, pinch yourself you're not. <laughs> okay. Um, soon your dream, dreams, again, coming through here, career will take flight and fully support you. So you see spirits indicating your dreams, Aquarius, your nighttime sleeping dreams and your daytime waking dreams, the dreams that you hold for yourself can become a reality. Spirit is giving you a solution right here. Work part-time moonlight in what it is that you would prefer to be doing while you are still working potentially your nine to five job or whatever to pay the bills until your moonlighting or your side kind of gig or hustle um, becomes larger than life and then takes over, okay? Becomes that dream that you have been um, holding on to and then it can be released into the world, right? Right, but that moonlighting coming through twice, I mean, spirit's not playing here, Aquarius double confirmation it says are you doing what you love are you <laughs> i mean that's that's basically i don't think we need to go into that much more aquarius are you doing what you love spirits asking because you know dreaming of abundance or dreams of abundance and that moonlighting energy coming through um is is pretty well confirmation and or indicating that um the answer may be no but you're the only one that can answer that for yourself okay so um spirits asking aquarius are you actually doing what you love and if not can you do what you don't love during the day to kind of pay the bills and get you what you do love off the ground? Now, look, you have abundance twice. Another confirmation coming through here, Aquarius. So there is abundance coming in. This one got a little jacked up, but it still is. <laughs> um, yeah, you've got dreams of abundance and abundance. So abundance is ready to come in, flowing in, Aquarius. Um, but it's time for you to take action. The ideas and downloads are here. Take action right? The dreams are coming through. The information is coming through. Solutions are coming through. Spirit is offering, uh, right? Do, do the moonlighting, right? Um, yeah. So the, the ideas and downloads are here. Of course, take action. Keep a journal, write things down, do a dream journal, do a, uh, but it, it doesn't even have to be like a, a sleeping dream journal. You could do a sleeping dream journal mixed with a daydream journal right uh, or a daytime when what your actual dreams are and then the dreams that come through at night with with messages and that sort of thing and then take action towards them moonlight uh, maybe intern if that is something um you know do uh if you need to go back to school or take a class or something for more information, do that. Or maybe even see if you can follow somebody, right? Some some of you might be interested in something um, that takes a little bit more schooling or uh, takes a little bit more, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Commitment. How's that? Um, and And see if you can follow somebody for a day that does that job to confirm or does that um side gig or or whatever see if you can follow them go to have a go to work with day right and see if that is something that you feel like you would enjoy but aquarius spirit just keeps bringing through with the stop playing spirit keeps confirming you know that that you have solutions there's information coming through you can do one and both now that may not always be ideal for everybody uh sometimes we may not want to work two jobs or work uh, our full-time job and then another but if you want to see this dream to fruition if you want to bring it in to have that abundance all around you which is already ready to flow in or flowing in Aquarius um, an abundance can come in many different categories many different ways it doesn't just have to be um, money it can come in with knowledge it can come in with um, uh, generosity it can come in with people willing to share can come in with things that you've overheard, but there is an abundance overflowing around you within your dreams, within um, your life in general and your money and career situation Aquarius is, is ready and um, ready to change. It's ready to uh, transform in a big way and action needs to be taken. And then you also have a completion, see it through. Okay. So spirits indicating Aquarius, don't just start and quit, start and quit, start and quit, stop playing and actually see it through to completion actually fulfill it actually do all the things move all the moving pieces get it all together and run with it okay stop playing Aquarius run with it see it through to completion let's see now so you've got the five of swords the king of pentacles the eight of cups here and the ace of pentacles so you see it's almost as if they're like every other right 
but you've got the five of swords and the eight of cups so for some of you aquarius with this combination the five of swords and the eight of cups some of you have been in a place where you're like okay um, I'm a little intimidated to do what it is that I want to do. Maybe I don't feel like I, I know enough, or maybe I, you know, have some conflicts or maybe there's some conflicts as far as money goes or paying the bills, right? With the five of swords, um, spirits indicating with that, that it's, it's, uh, either way, Aquarius, the days are going to pass. Okay. The days are going to pass. It's time to leave what's unfulfilling and, or start something on the side moonlight so that you can leave something that's unfulfilling because all this is doing Aquarius by staying within this. If this is your situation or relevant to you is it continues to kind of suck life force energy out of you. Um, instead of bringing about this energy of kind of, um, passion, you see, you're always in your thoughts or your emotions. It's like, it's, it's over kind of, um, whelm or this energy of, of just, um, not really living is what's coming through here. And your job, Aquarius, the work that you do, um, the career that you have, what have you, if you think about it, you spend the majority of your life, the majority of your time doing that. So if it's not something that you love, it's not worth it. So, right. Why keep doing it? I understand. I did it for over 20 years. I stayed in a life sucking, unfulfilling job because, you know, I thought that that's what I needed to do to take care of the kids and to do this and to pay the bills and what have you. And I was so upset and angry and bitter all the time. Um, and it really, really wasn't worth it. Okay. So, um, when I left and, and ventured out, now this is my own story, doesn't need to be yours, um, ventured out on my own, I got a new lease on life. And so spirits indicating, you know, things are, abundance is all around you, Aquarius. When you, you know, it, it's going to come in whether, whether you, you know, want it to or whether you make a decision or not. But holding off on doing this, Aquarius, is just hurting you more in the long run. And it's just sucking more life force energy out of you because the King of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles are here. You see, the King of Pentacles is a very, very strong energy. The King of Pentacles is all about success. And the King of Pentacles knows how to go out and build that success, knows that even if things don't work out this time, that they will work out in the long run. The King of Pentacles is, is this energy that's um, a very encouraging money as far as money and career go. Look, you've got two big money cards to close this reading, Aquarius. The money is on its way. The money will come, okay? Um, that doesn't mean that there won't be some days where it's kind of ebb and flow or feels a little bit of struggle bus, right? But Spirit's indicating it's time to just stop playing because you have this energy here, Aquarius. You've got financial and career milestones to meet. You get to rise up and you get to move into a place where for some of you, you might even be able to indulge a little bit and or have some financial security. That Ace of Pentacles is a big money card. Money coming in and um, new work, new business, new career opportunities and new financial opportunities showing up. There's big investments to be made and Aquarius, there's a lot of resources around you. Big money cards coming through here, Aquarius, means that if you choose, right, to um, really do this moonlighting, Spirit doesn't put you out there without giving you suggestions, ideas, and um, potential solutions or things that you can do, right? Um, and it's coming through your dreams, keeping that journal, right? There's so much that you can do. Take advantage of Aquarius. Stop playing. Run with it. Do the dang thing. And your life could be so much better for it. But if you don't, Aquarius, you're just going to continue in that same cycle day after day, week after week, month after month, year after year, um, for fear of kind of um, making any changes or making any progress, holding yourself back. Spirit's like, don't do it. Stop playing in Christ. Run with it. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. You've got it. Okay. Big money wanting to come in abundance all around you. Abundance, abundance, all this confirmation of Christ. What are you waiting for? Okay. All right. I do intend this resonated with you and for you. If it did, please do hit the like button and share this video. It does help others to be able to see these messages that might not otherwise. Also feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you're notified every time I upload new readings. It is free for you to subscribe to the YouTube channel and it does support the Lucky Stars community in growing and thriving. As always, I do wish you lots of hope, lots of joy, and lots and lots of love with all of your current and future endeavors. I'll see you in the next reading.